Was that an awesome battle or what? Because I have no idea what I tell you, but welcome back for more of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword because this game is going to be a really good, really great long LP of all time of this channel right here and it will continue to grow for more viewers and those people new and not and those who are already <laughs> subscribed to this channel alike <laughs> Someone associated with the Academy? I'm pretty sure I might have a pretty good clue of I know who it is. It's the headman. I'm pretty sure the headmaster might know this really well. Because he has to know. I'm pretty sure he does know this. Oh, come on! I couldn't do a thing! I'm totally useless! Wow, he feels like he felt like a... He feels like he's a total... Did not work. A woodland rhino beetle. I always wanted to get one of those. I'm just dead weight. What kind of use is that to anyone? Why? Hey, don't be such a crybaby. Everything's gonna be okay. But seriously, think about think about this. Grooseland! It's like it doesn't make sense. I know it doesn't make sense, but still. What do you expect for a guy who calls the name of Grooseland anyways? It just why not name Hyrule, not Bruce Land, because Hyrule would have been way better, but right now the name Hyrule does not exist. Not yet. Not right now. Way later. Until that time comes, it will be later. In the near future. Whoa! Tells me. Oh! I'm not sure if that's gonna work, but I'm gonna give it a try. Big. And again, it will not work. Yeah, I, I kind of knew it did not work. It's like, how do you know that? Because uh, I tried it. Super feathers! That was not as easy as you think it is now, doesn't it? <laughs> Alright, time to head out that way. <laughs> I don't need to be here anymore. Huh? Get 
get my sword stronger. I'm pretty sure I might know what it is. It's not a secret, and I'm pretty sure Austin Lawrence knows this well, too. Oh, great God! I have found some! Found some what? Oh. Look, those butterflies that respond to beautiful tones are swarming all over this place. This has to be the right spot! Mm -hmm. Oh, this could be a problem. I cannot carry a tune. I could not create beautiful tones and wild, wild animals threaten to roll me down a hill! What can we do? Beautiful tone? Mm -hmm. Uh... That's how I did it? Boring. That is it! One of the talking statues of the ancient ex -Poker. There is just no mistaking it. Oh, thanks. If you find a spot swarmed with butterflies, play a tune of great beauty and a gossip stone might just pop out. Ah, got it. Just oh. like the old text say, buddy. It appeared with a boing oing and spoke in some strange mm -hmm. tongue. This is a major leap forward in my study of the talking statue. Next up are those goddess balls. I have got an inkling I will not have to look very far for those either. And I mean to fight one no matter what. Thanks. Now, if you excuse me, I'm gonna head way up to the sky. Yes. How will Groose get out of here? I have no idea. But it seems he's not gonna come back if you want to know. He's, I think he wants to stay. I think he really wants to stay in the surface. But will he ever see his friends again? Is that my guess? I don't know. That is up to him. If you want to know, that is up to him. <laughs> Pretty obvious I might know who while I find. I got extra hearts if you want to know from the from the, when I did some grinding if you want to know. I thought that you know there are butterflies there, but then again I was Someone close to the academy might know a thing or two about Z about Zelda a little more than I do. Hey! Hey, I just checked Bruce's room and w the guy was gone. You got any idea where he went? Maybe he had to run away because of his broken heart? <laughs> what a tough guy. <laughs> uh... Yeah, what a tough guy. If he ever gets over. Fledge. I'm Fledge! Fledge man! Let's see if he's here. Ah! Oh, you're back, Leonardo. Got to say you're still in one piece. So how's it going down there? Are you any closer to finding myself? Well... Hmm. 
is from that stone tablet that was on top of that stone tower right here on Skyloft. He said, O oh youth, guided by the servant of the goddess, unite earth and sky and bring light to the land. That's the first part, but as I recall, there's a second verse to the song. A second verse, really? Tower, and before you a path shall open, and a heavenly song you shall hear. I believe that's the whole thing. Light tower mentioned in the song is a real place. I'm sure you've seen the tower in the plaza. I don't know a thing about two whirling sails, though. It sounds like the song is suggesting that if one shows these words and sails the way to the tower, something will happen. But how do you go about doing that, and what does it mean? I might have a pretty good idea. Unless if they needed help on something, uh, I, earn, I can try to earn gratitude crystals if you want to know. So far, I only got like over 20. The only way I need to get more of the gratitude crystals is to reach 30 if you want to know. Okay, so he doesn't need any help or something. I mean, who knows? Still can't eat her room. That tower right there. That's what I was talking about. That tower you see right there? Pretty sure I can figure this out. Let sound the goddess's song beneath the light radiance onto her chosen hero shall fall a piercing ray of guidance. Right here? It does not work. But that is the tower here. Yes, I hear something. Objective. 
Right. <laughs> That's how quick I am. I remember the two whirling sails that, uh, that someone mentioned. This is a one whirling sail, as I recall. Missing a pinwheel, if you want to know. <laughs> Missing a pinwheel. Hey! What's up? So you're curious about that windmill, eh? Very smart design, I gotta say. See, you can turn the windmill so that it can always catch the wind no matter which way it's blowing. <laughs> but, well, there used to be this little propeller attached to the windmill so you could turn it. The thing flew off ages ago. It must have dropped off, uh, off the, down the edge, off the edge, down beneath the clouds. The clouds? Windmill's been Uselessly sitting there ever since. Reorient the wind. You wanna know if I could fix the windmill if you brought back the propeller? Well, if I had the propeller, I could probably rig something together to get it back on there, sure. Something falls through the clouds, it's gone for good. Hang on. Come to think of it, Gondo at the scrap shop told me that someone in his family once used a flying robot to all jump back from beneath the clouds. We're talking about a tale that's been passed down over a lot of years, so I wouldn't put much stock in it. I think I know who you're talking about. Isn't he the blacksmith? <laughs> Let's go talk to him and see if what he has in mind. Into the merchant's plaza. Or the bazaar is most likely. Ah! Someone needs help. Get something off your chest. I think I know what it is. You've got a favor to ask me, right? Uh, yes. Huh? Huh? Uh, it's about this old robot my grandpa used to take her around with. You probably just came here to make fun of the crazy junk guy for believing in his grandpa's stupid stories, right? Well, get in line. I've heard of it before. Wait. That's not why you're here. You say you need to pick up something from below the clouds with this robot. You know what that means? That means you believe in my grandpa's stories too, don't you? 
Uh, kind of, sort of. Well, I'm happy to hear that someone else believes me, but I don't think I can help you to save my grandpa's old robot. Wait, that's right, I remember. His name is Scrapper. He may not be much to look at these days, but he was an amazing robot once. When you called him, he would go anywhere and haul anything. Sadly, as you can see now, he's just another busted old hunk of junk. But old Gramps did tell me this. You can get him working again with the extract from an ancient flower. It's like oil to this guy. Wow, but I've never heard of much, much less see and such anything. Take mine! Ooh, what? You have one? Are you kidding me? That's amazing! Ooh, -hoo 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 -hoo. so this is an ancient flower. Can feel some slick, oily stuff coming out of this stem. Great! With this, we can fix Scrapper. Wait right there, we'll have him up and running a no time. Whew. Woo! There you go. All right. He's alive! Thank you, Pink. I've got a full tank of energy, and I'm ready to carry anything. Huh? Who is this green clad individual of small stature? <laughs> Whoa, we're talked! Can you believe that? I guess I really did fix him! This young man gave me the materials I needed to fix you. Go on, say thank you. Are you sure it was him? <laughs> well then, I extend my reluctant thanks to you and gesture of obligatory gratitude. <laughs> oh! Oh now, watch it! There's no way to talk to someone who just saved your life! Anyway, this this young man wants you to hold some stuff around it. You're going to help him. This individual may have restored my operations, but I am not inclined to offer assistance. Serving, serving children is very low in my task priorities. A fallen propeller. I see. Oh my you! Your name is Spy. Should I call you Mystery Spy? Are you looking for something, Mystery Spy? I, I understand. At your request, I will carry anything, regardless of weight or destination. Yahoo! At least you are being kind for this young fella here. Master Short Pants, I offer assistance. I cannot detect Mistress Spy's thought waves. Could I, could you meet me? Ask Mistress Spy to call me and I will arrive with a sack. Oh, how did you plan to recover all that stuff that fell beneath the clouds? You know, you could always ask the fortune teller over there. I know he's kind of goofy looking, but when it comes to finding things, he's always right on the money! Thanks. Uh, you know, I'm never gonna get this over with, but I do like his enthusiasm. I really like it! Now we got a helper! Yay! A helper! And it seems we are going to stop here for the time being, and we are going to continue to pick up from where we left off, and thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, 
comment, favorite, and subscribe. And tell me, what do you guys think of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword? Do you like it or hate it? Mash that like button and or share this video. If you guys love hack and slash games such as myself, or what is your favorite Legend of Zelda game of all time? Or who is your favorite Legend of Zelda character of all time? Whichever works in your book. As your friendly neighborhood superhero who takes chances making mistakes and getting messy, who likes peanut butter and chocolate and or breakfast or dinner. Godspeed, play safe, and shalom. Remember to fight with honor, love, truth, and justice. And see you guys next time for more of Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword on the Nintendo Wii and the Nintendo Switch. Friendship is magic for everyone. And we just gained some new friends because everything in this game is Arkham.